Good morning everybody! It's me again, Grace Bag Lady. I'm still a bit croaky. Um, obviously I've been poorly for a week and my mum always says it takes two weeks to get over everything and I kind of think she's right. So we're kind of halfway through. My throat is still a bit sore but oh, I think it was all the excitement of the weekend. What a lovely party day. Yay! So we did it. We successfully did a children's party. <laughs> Um, and last night I did have a few glasses of red wine to celebrate after I'd finished and done and tidied up and everything and so I'm feeling a bit delicate this morning. <laughs> anyway my dears, it's Monday morning, I've not had my breakfast yet but I've just got back off school run so I need to be back on Slimming World. I was doing really well, obviously I've been really naughty over the weekend but no more cake. <laughs> so we need to get our heads back in gear so again I want to go back to eating different things again so let's have a look what we can have for breakfast. Right, breakfast this morning. I'm having a banana, some melon slices and a little yoghurt, a little tiny one. Um, it is a day out of day, but it'll be fine. We've only just left the 29th, haven't we? So I'll have to enjoy my breakfast. Oh, don't eat out of date melon. It was horrible, so I didn't eat it. I nibbled on some of it and it just tasted really sour and horrible. So yeah, I didn't eat the melon. <laughs> so I'm just going to have a few grapes now because obviously I didn't eat the melon. So I've had the banana, I've had the yogurt. I'm going to have a few grapes. Then we need to decide what we're doing today. Right, I've made it into the car. I've got changed. I decided I didn't like that pink jumper. You know, sometimes you put something on and I looked at myself in the mirror and thought, do you know that jumper really doesn't suit you? I don't think I suit v-necks and I don't think the pink really did much for me. It just didn't seem to go. So uh, I got changed. I've got a really, really glittery jumper on. It's absolutely bonkers. Look at it. It's amazing. The trouble is it's a bit heavy, so it kind of drops forward a bit. So I have to keep pulling it back, but I love it. So I put that on. And then bag of the day. You wear it with seams bag for a very long time. Ta-da! It's my Louis Vuitton Speedy 25. Um, this was my first Louis Vuitton, started my love of Louis Vuitton. It's a bit worn, the handles are very patinaed and a bit worn, but I kind of like the history behind it. I wonder where it's been and what it got up to and stuff. So this is the bag of the day. Oh, it's so cute, I love it. My favorite bag, I don't think I'll ever part with this bag. It's just like, it's just me, <laughs> a bit worn out. <laughs> anyway, my dear, so we need to go and fetch some topsoil um, because my grass is being delivered tomorrow, my new bit of grass. So we need to go and get some topsoil and I want to have a look at some stepping stones. Let's go. I've got me soil stuff what I need. So he's telling me what to do, I've got to like lay it down, squash it down, then get ready for my grass coming. So I still, they didn't have any stepping stones, so I don't know where to drive to another garden centre and have a quick look to see if they've got any stepping stones. Let's go.
We've arrived at one more garden centre. I've not had any luck so far. No stepping stones. I don't think this one will have them either, but I was passing here on the way back, so I thought we'll have a quick look and then we'll go home. I need to do some like moving of gravel and stuff, so let's go. Back in the car. Right, it's now 25 to 12. We really need to go home. I've been here too long. I get myself lost when I look at plants. I just stand there like staring at them. So anyway, I bought some little heathers from my garden. So that'd be nice because they're evergreen. So they'll stay green, green all winter. So let's get home. Right, I'm home. So super fast dinner because I need to go outside before it absolutely chucks it down with rain. So I've got quick scrambled egg on toast with tomato. So off to enjoy my quick dinner. Right, this is the bit, ooh, I've got a wasp near me. <laughs> this is the bit that I've got to clear when this wasp goes away. Go away. Um, I've got to clear this bit because I want to put some grass down here. Then I'm gonna make like a little divider with some um, smashed up slabs that we're going to reuse. So this bit is gonna be grass. So I think it'll look really nice when it's done. It's gonna rain soon. So I thought if I can clear a bit of the gravel now, it will help but it's just hard work. Oh, this is so horrible. So I'm trying to get as much of the gravel out of this as I can and put it over there where we still want gravel. But it's just horrible. It's all muddy and it's just, it's horrible. This is one of the most horrible jobs ever. <laughs> Serious digging. I've got to try and turn all this over. <laughs> oh, I've been trying to dig that tree up for the last half an hour. The tree is one. I can't get out. <laughs> oh, no words. Why is it some people look really glamorous when they do gardening and I just end up like a sweaty tomato? <laughs> so anyway, anyway, more tools needed. I've only got half an hour because I'm waiting for a very important parcel to come. So I've only got to half past two. My mother-in-law is doing school run for me so I can wait for my parcel coming. Woohoo! Um, but I just want to get through this tree root. If I can cut through this tree root, I think I can get the tree up. It has killed me. <sighs> But I'm determined this bloody tree's not winning, so let's go and chop that root. I've done it! <laughs> Yay! I won! Jane won, tree zero. <laughs> it's hard work, but I'm loving watching it all come together. It's getting really nice. I love it so much. I'm so glad that we put the work in. Oh, I'm around the front now, so I won't miss my parcel. But I want to put my little heathers in that I bought this morning. So I'm just going to put them along here, I think. 
Yeah, look at these mushrooms I've just dug up. Wow, never had any that big before. Parcels arrived! Yay! So both and parcels have arrived. Uh, dinner's underway. So tonight we're having mashed potato, roast potato, lots of vegetables and stewing today in gravy, which is really nice. Um, we're just waiting for the roast potatoes there in the oven. So I'm just um, waiting for my tea to cook. I'm so hungry and I'm so tired now. My legs are killing after digging that blooming tree up. Right, we have a parcel. We're so excited. <laughs> A lovely lady Hi. called Gloria. I know she didn't want me to mention her name, but Gloria, we love you. Mm -hmm. And um, she sent me a parcel. Cheers. So, two parcels. Gloria doesn't live in England, so the fact she's gone to all this trouble to even get them arranged to come over it's here is amazing. Oh. No, there's no heating on. So she's, oh my God. So she's treating me to a little present. So this one is for me, and then there's another box for me and Ruby to share. Oh my God. I'm speechless. Right, let's just put this over here. So, are we ready? Are you ready? Oh, oh something else. <coughs> oh, Is that like a stamp <coughs> sticker? Because <coughs> they look like stamps. <laughs> I can't stop coughing. <laughs> right, yes, it's um, it's a sticker, I think, isn't it? Make it look old fashioned like a heat uh, stamp. It's just that the packaging's absolutely beautiful. As we all know, I love packaging as well. So here we have. So we've got some beautiful Chanel hand cream. Not like false nails, because it's like a circle on the front. <laughs> and then we've got. Oh my goodness, there's all sorts of stuff. Oh, we've got some samples of perfume. Oh, wow. So we've got perfume sample in a gorgeous little dust bag. Oh wow. And then we've got some posh eye makeup remover. Isn't this wonderful? I've still got some eyeshadow and I need that. <laughs> we've got a little compact mirror. Oh wow. Mm -hmm. oh, I think there's something under there. There is, yeah, look how it's packed. I know we're touching them Oh, it's so beautiful. Got confetti worms. Yeah, it has. That's what I call them. Look how they folded all this paper. Confetti worms. And then we've got... Yay! Confetti worms underneath. <laughs> and then we've got this gorgeous lipstick. Oh, wow. In soft rose. Let's see if I can open it up and have a look. <gasps> there we go. I Why is it three? It's two in one, I think. So one uh, end's the colour and the other end's like the setting stuff. Oh, that's good. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. I need to put that out. That is that absolutely up. amazing. Because my eyeshadow is not coming out. <laughs> what, the eye makeup? Yeah, <laughs> I need some Max. Right, so, so oh Gloria. Right. Here's some the one I want. Ruby's very excited about this one. Yeah. Mm. I can smell already. There's yeah. something very beautiful, very smelly and beautiful in here. Yummy. <laughs> it smells oh, like, wow. like apricots or something. Oh. My yes, precious yes. parcel. <laughs> Careful. It smells amazing. Ooh, it oh, it smells like flowers. Oh, oh it smells like... It's <gasps> A little extra gift for you to celebrate Ruby's birthday since you're her mum. Sincerely, Gloria. It smells, oh, there's oh. like weird things. It's like weird squishy things. Oh, wow. Squishy bones. Squishy bones. Oh, there's lavender. Yeah, I can see the lavender. So let's, let's put these on the table. Snowing! <laughs> don't put them on the floor because the dog will them. No. So they don't use, I think it's um, Lush, isn't it? They don't use any packaging, so it is actually the soap that's actually oh, in here. Right, I'll oh. try and get that. Oh, that's cool. Oh, loads. It's like bits of lavender. Careful, they might crack. Right, let me just uh, pause this while I get to it. Hang on. Mm. 
Right, there's all our goodies. Oh wow, I cannot tell you how nice our kitchen now smells. So here's all my instructions. Gloria has already sent me a message about them. So I kind of understand what you have to do. So um, you have to like break them up and put them under the running water yeah. and stuff. And they just smell absolutely beautiful and they make so many bubbles. I'm so excited to try these. Don't they smell nice, Ruby? Oh, they're so lovely. Gloria, thank you so much. Honestly, I can't thank you enough. This, this is, is so awesome. exciting. And I'm so excited to try the lipsticks and the Chanel. And I just can't thank you enough. Thank you so much. I just like the phone things. <laughs> Ruby. Oh, after all the excitement, I'm now going to go and have my tea. My tea looks a bit boring, doesn't it? <laughs> so I've got lots of edge, which I've covered with the stream steak. And then I've got some little fake roast potatoes that I've made. So I'll have to enjoy my day. Half past six at night. It's nearly dark and it is absolutely pouring down. And my kitchen smells the most beautiful smell of soap. <laughs> it smells wonderful. Half past seven at night. It's pitch black and it's pouring with rain. I don't know if you can hear this. So miserable. I think winter has arrived. Right, we're ready with our box of tricks, Gloria. <laughs> we're going to run ourselves the most wonderful bath ever. We're so excited, I can't tell you. So, um, the makeup from Chanel we're going to try tomorrow, the lipsticks. I want to see if it lasts all day. So, for tonight, we're just going to try the uh, bubble bath. So, without further ado, let's get the tap running. Right, we've crumbled it in. We've gone for the purple one because it said about uh, being relaxing for bedtime. And it smells of lavender. Doesn't it smell nice, Ruby? Yeah. Ooh, it's lovely. Right, my dears, final little vlog of the day. Thank you so much for joining me today. I'm off for the world's biggest bubble bath. I'm so ready for this bubble bath, I can't tell you. Oh, so excited. So it is, I love you and leave you. So if you do enjoy life in England, daily vlogs, handbags, shopping, bubble baths, and anything else we get up to, then please subscribe to my channel and come and find me on Instagram as Mrs. Crazy Bag Lady. So I love you and leave you. I'll speak to you tomorrow. Bye.